You know, on Fishing 401, you see us fishing the offshore board an awful lot, and it's very common for us to fish two, three, and sometimes as many as four boards aside. And in order to do that, you have to rig them a special way so that we can trip a board, maybe just to clear a lure that's not being productive, or possibly to fight a fish without having to clear all the other lines that might be in the way. It's something we call the loop trick, and it's a really simple way to fish an offshore board. And the good news is when you buy an offshore board, they come factory rigged with the right releases on them. You don't have to buy any extra gear. All I'm going to do here is reach up and grab my line. I already have my crankbait out in the water, so I'm just going to grab the line in my hand and I'm going to spin it a few times. And what I've done is just created a small loop. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to take that twisted part of the line and I'm going to put it in the front release. That front release is called an OR19, it's the orange one, and you can see there's, there's just a little loop of line here extending out the front of the release. Then there's a second release in the back of the board, and that's called an OR16, and I'm going to put the line in there, and it's important to note that in the red release there's a pin in here, so you have to put the line behind the pin. Now we have tattle flags on here, and so in order to make the tattle flag work, I have to give a little bit of slack line so the tattle flag can work. The beauty of this setup is that when I drop it in there and put it out to the side, when I get a bite, when I give the line a little pull, it's going to pop free from the front release and the board is just going to be attached onto the line by the second release, the back release. So essentially the board is still pinned in position, but it's not planing anymore. The beauty of that is that now it drops out of the pattern so that it doesn't get tangled with any other lines that might be out there. So you can have three, four, even five lines aside and be able to fight fish and never have to clear any lines from your trolling pattern. It's a beautiful trolling technique and it's called the loop trick.